One turn. Good evening, everybody. What? What? Good Hello, everybody. <laughs> but now you said. We should do a pooper reel. Yeah. Good evening. We're in Epcot tonight. We got Joe with us. Hi. Because we're going to see Kenny G tonight. Good which is Kenny. why I got my new sunglasses on. They finally came by Weirwood. Sarah will put the link down below. So far, I like them. I've only owned them for about 36 hours, but they seem pretty good. They're we'll lightweight. We'll test them out. We'll let you know. Sarah wants a pair. Yeah, they're scary. Yes, yeah, so they're like the weird ones without the rim on the bottom. Right? But they're really cool, and they're like a small shop, so check them out. Epcot, you did me dirty. All I wanted, because we only have eight more places to get something to eat at food and wine. So we were going to hit up maybe one or two or three of those before Kenny G. And I was like, hmm, what's the best way to start food and wine? Cleanse a palate with a nice little glass of Beverly. Go to Club Cool. Well, at one station. Not two, not three, not four, not five. All of the stations. We're out of Beverly. So I didn't even get, I even went to one and I tried it. I was like, maybe it's got some in the pipe still. No, it's just straight seltzer water. So, not, not appealing. Sarah tried telling me that they're discontinuing it. She's fabricating that. They're not going to discontinue it. It's Beverly. What would the world do? Guys, we actually, uh, have we been here since we moved here? We've been in here, I think, once since we moved here. They have a ton of Day of the Dead stuff in here now. Look at that, that's incredible. The bridal couple displayed here has an oversized parade float and is a popular theme seen throughout the holiday. The couple symbolizes the love that will endure long after death. Wow! <laughs> down below does Eve look more like the dog or does Eve look more like the cat she kind of for sure is a cat I think I say it every time but one of these days I'm gonna get a jumper from Norway six seven years six years been coming here I I'm obsessed with these, but they're $300, one day. I want a blue one in a large or an extra large size so I can snug my body and stay warm when I'm in Chicago. Right, Jill? In a bottle. This is Jill. Jill was, Jill was born to represent the essence of Norway. What's it actually called? It is called um, the essence of Norway. Is that what it is? Oh, it's called Layla? Yes, oh, but it's, it's called Layla, the essence of Norway. Jill has been literally obsessed with this since she was born. They have deodorant and perfume. She bathed in it. You met the creator of it? I met, Gear I Ness. met this guy over here. From, this, is him. this is a tour by Jill. Right here. I met him Thanksgiving 2011. They have a picture together. Sarah will put it right now. <laughs> A woman on a mission. And in the kimchi hot dog, which is like, this stand is always here, it just happens to have a wine option. You gotta check it out. My Look at goodness. The sunset. We have important, two important options. You're so dark. What's wrong with this area? This way, this way, this way. This way over here. Uh, Can you see me? Yeah. We have two extremely important updates. One. It's already dark, too dark to wear my sunglasses, so that lasts like four <laughs> seconds. The two, look at this hot dog. I had no idea it was this big. This is the kimchi hot dog, six ninety three, from Cool Cool Post. Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, Peter. Tell us how it is. It's gonna be completely graceful. Dig it? Is yeah. it? Does it taste like the kimchi place by our old apartment? 
Um, it tastes like fresher. Ooh. Like what is it, onions? What's on there? It's very like fresh and spicy. Nothing free. I could have sworn, I feel like it's hit or miss. I think I've gotten free candy in here. Me too. Mm. So we're getting in this line? I don't know, are we? We came here to see Kenny G, and the cast member at the front was like, that's why it's busy today. A lot of people are here to see Kenny G. And I was like, really? People are here to see Kenny G? Um, excuse me? Look at this line. This is all for the next Kenny G show. I had no idea. So we're not going to wait in line. We're going to just like either stand in the back if they let us, or just continuously walk back and forth for the 20 minute show. So Sound good? Huh? Sound good? Sound great. I don't know what I'm talking about. Sounds like a plan. Isn't it great? They have such faith in me. Ooh, we are deviating from <laughs> food and wine and we're getting the pumpkin spice funnel cake. It was $8.93 with tax. And it's at the funnel cakes right outside of the American Pavilion. And it's gonna be good. They make it fresh right in there. I've heard that this tastes like it's made of the same stuff that like pumpkin pie is made with. So I'm very excited. Christmas, it smells like Christmas. It smells like Christmas. What does it taste like? Does it taste like Christmas? Is it hot? It tastes really hot. It tastes really hot. Jill, get in there. I think we need to let it cool. It smells like Christmas. I don't smell anything or it tastes like Christmas. Maybe I just feel like fried. Here, desserts. hold this. I will. I will go in there. Did anybody notice that Peter's wearing a Zepcot shirt? <laughs> Can you taste the pumpkin? Whoa on it. Thoughts? It's super good. It's the right kind of, it's the right amount of pumpkin. It's like a pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> like this video. Whenever you heard Kenny G tonight, you, you thought of Kevin G and the power of three. You know what I'm talking about? Look at this little light behind you. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, Mean Girls. I was, I thought it was familiar. I was Kevin G in the Power 3 in high school. Me too. Did you guys know that? We were both mathletes. I said Sarah was a mathlete. I was requested. Was that, that was that was requested? That was in junior high when you were, when we were just in the photo. But in high school. But I was requested to be a mathlete. Yeah, but I was conference champion two years in a row. Dweeb. Love you though. I love my dweeb. I'm proud of it. I'm proud of you for it. And she was voted. And then she was voted best actor of our class. Look at her go. What was the girl's name in Singing in the Rain? That you were. I was like the lady in green. That was junior year. Though. You were the lady in green in Singing in the Rain. I, it was my senior year where I had my first singing. Which was? It was a musical about Will Rogers. And I was just like a showgirl, but I was like the narrator. Check out Will, Will Rogers Follies. <laughs> That's Sarah's life. We're not sure what's happening. Sarah's off running around the countries, and me and Jill are just chilling here. And I think Kenny G's getting started five minutes early. But this is the view we decided to have since it'll be more enjoyable. We're a little further away. That's Kenny G over there. But like Jill pointed out, we got this great view. We get Mickey pretzels galore. Life's good. The six of us up here are products of the United States public school system with music in the schools. Thank you, America. All right, let's have fun tonight. Thank you so much, everyone. We're, we're gonna have a great time.
Well, there you have it, everybody. We saw Kenny G. We did it. And, and Jill has a hoodie on. She's singing. She's celebrating her coming to parade. She's wearing a Spectrum Magic parade t shirt. It's no longer on. But Kenny G was great. And the kimchi dog was great. And the pumpkin spice funnel was cake. And Jill's pretzel looks great. Everything is great. Because you know what? Great. No, no, no. Everything it's, is great. It's a, I was introing a different song. Oh. There's a great song. No. That's my ring song. Where are we at? No. No. We're going into the UK. No. We're at Epcot. We're on a yes. Bridge. One little spark. No. Had to do with our food. Hot dog. Hot diggity dog. It's close. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to food and wine. Oh, food and wine. Duh. Everybody loves food and wine. I'm so disappointed in these two. I was, I was thinking way too hard into it. Illuminations, reflections of us. Jules, did you enjoy that Beverly in there? No. Oh wait. There. It wasn't even there. Good thing we had, had some last Friday. Good thing what? Good thing we had some last Friday. Oh yeah, we did. We went to go to the Coke store. And did they say when they say it's gonna be back? Tomorrow. Tomorrow or Thursday. They will have more Beverly. Like video. We love the music. Three way up. Comment down below if you love the music outside of the fountain. Because that's what Jill and I had to listen to for six, da, 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 da. For six straight months while we worked here. Because Jill worked right outside at the train station, and I worked in a lot of the problem. Well, Future World. Guys. Okay, Miss Magic Kingdom, go to a Halloween party or a Christmas I party. I did work at Splash Mountain, and I did wear her dress. So. Jill, Jill's entire goal of the Disney College program was to get on as many costumes as possible. And I never even took pictures of them. Yeah, come on. That's because like Instagram took, and Snapchat wasn't a thing. Jill then. took um, throwaway camera photos because I remember looking. They're called dis <laughs> they're, they're called disposable cameras. Um, I have an album, <laughs> and you. Hey, so do it we. Up, we have an album too. You look at the pictures. That's how old I am. <laughs> so we're getting our couch in two days. It's in Virginia right now. When we woke up, it was in Jersey, and this afternoon it was in Maryland. And now it's in Virginia. Should be here, supposed to be here Thursday sometime. I can't wait to do our sign off from it. We're gonna do our sign off from it because we're notorious. You can go back to our old uh, channel doing Vlogmas from Thanksgiving to Christmas and see how many times we fell asleep on the couch and showed you creepy Santa. I can't wait to introduce you to creepy <laughs> Santa. Just wait, it's my- We need to find him. Oh, I know exactly where creepy Santa is. Okay. I can't wait to show you and introduce you. Guys, next week is super busy. Well, not as busy as I thought because... The couch change. The couch was originally supposed to come next Wednesday and next Tuesday, Eva's getting spayed and four baby teeth are getting pulled because they're like stuck. That little surgery. So that's Tuesday. Wednesday was going to be the couch, but now it's going to come this week. Tuesday's also Halloween. Tuesday's also Halloween and Sarah flies out Thursday? Thursday. Thursday morning, so I'm gonna work from home Thursday and Friday, I think, to be with the pup. Oh, and then it's gonna be me and the pup all Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But we're gonna include footage from my trip to Chicago as well, so that'll be our first little I'm mix. I'm still gonna go to Disney World, even if I'm by myself. <laughs> You'll find friends. Matt's actually gonna be here. Yes, actually, we are going out for one of our friends' birthdays next weekend, and yeah. it'll be fun. I'm gonna whoop it up while Sarah's gone. Yeah. It's just like all of a sudden it's here. It's just crazy. So get ready for that. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.